Welcome to Wife in the Country. Today I would like to show you how I whitewashed my terracotta pots uh, for planting a kitchen garden on my dining table. I started out trying to paint the base of the planters with uh, just solid white paint. I thought maybe I could use a rag to kind of blend it and make it have the textured look of whitewash and still get a really strong white color, which is what I was after. But when I went to use the cloth, I discovered that it was just too thick. It was already sinking into the terracotta, and it just wasn't going to work uh, the way I was wanting, which is why I was trying it out on the base of the planters first to experiment. So I went and found myself a little disposable Ziploc plastic container, put a little bit of paint in it, and decided to add some water just a little tiny bit, maybe a tablespoon or two, to water it down to the consistency that I liked. I mixed the water up really good with the paint, took a couple minutes of stirring to get it to blend really nicely. And then I was ready to try it again on a second base of the planter to see if this was gonna work and get the texture that I wanted. I really liked having three tries to get the consistency that I wanted before I had to paint the pots where it was going to be more visible. So I put it on um, kind of loosely with the stroke of the brush, letting it uh, kind of feather out a little bit and then blended it how I liked with the rag. When I was looking for pots, I was a little bit frustrated with how expensive everything was. It was about $15 to $20 per pot. So when I found these terracotta pots, they were about $3 each, and I just used paint that was left over from a kitchen project a couple years ago. So it worked out really nicely. By the third try, I was feeling pretty confident to be able to get the look that I was after, and I was ready to try it out on the pots. Again, I wanted to start in an unnoticeable area, so I started from the base of the planters and worked my way up to make sure that I was getting uh, the look that I really wanted. I was really happy with how it looked, just going ahead and uh, swooping the brush all the way around. Um, I did three strokes. I did the first stroke on the bottom, and then I took the cloth and kind of scraped it off to where I liked the whitewash look and texture that I was getting and then I did a second strip in the middle and a third stroke to get the top and kind of the rim of the planter. And then I went back and um, did the inside of the pots just about two inches down to kind of make uh, the inside be white down to where I would be putting the soil level so that it would look white um, all around. This is the consistency of the paint that I used for my whitewash base. Uh, not too runny, but a little bit. And here's the finished pots. That one there is my favorite. The one in the middle I feel like got a little bit thin, but they all turned out pretty nicely. I like how white they are. I wanted a more solid white, where most of the whitewashing that I saw was pretty thin.
Thanks so much for watching. Next up, I'll be showing you uh, planting my herbs in these containers as my kitchen garden. So look forward to that next up on the channel.